take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Experts believe that these large gatherings of crows may provide warmth, protection, social opportunities, and a chance to share knowledge about food sources. Before heading to the roost, smaller groups of crows gather in what's known as staging areas, rather than flying directly to the roost. Point one two May 2020. Make your mark, take our lead. So if you see crows often, the universe is telling you something. This raven-colored bird is associated with the great mysteries of life. If you keep seeing crows around, you need to pay extra attention to the messages they bring. These birds are usually associated with dark omen and death in mythology. Take our lead. God told Job that part of the evidence for God's care of his creation was that he fed the ravens, Job chapter 38 verse 41, a theme that both a psalmist, Ps 147-9, and Jesus echoed, consider the crows. They don't plant or harvest. They don't even have a storeroom or a barn. Yet, God feeds them. Point one six August 2016. Take our lead. Two crows. Seeing just a single crow is considered an omen of bad luck. Finding two crows, however, means good luck. Three crows mean health, and four crows mean wealth. Yet spotting five crows means sickness is coming, and witnessing six crows means death is nearby, the 12th of January 2020. Let's help you make your mark. In daylight, crows can elude or gang up on most predators. At night, they are almost defenseless, so they gather in large flocks to roost in a spot where they have good visibility and reasonable shelter. Although crows congregate in rural areas, if there is a town nearby, they'll take advantage of it. Point one two December 2019. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.